Good morning, good morning everybody. I'm back at the farm and uh, today I'm going to be collecting black soldier vi compost and I wanted to share this precious moment with you. <laughs> so, um, I want you to take a look at what I've done before this is the black soldier fly compost. Like, this species of organisms are very good in breaking down bio waste and bringing it into the best compost ever. A lot of people are used to compost from pigs, compost from cows, compost uh, from rabbits, uh, but black soldier fly compost is really rich. I want you to take a look at it. It's really, really rich. It's really rich. So let me put some here so you can see. It's really rich. So this is going to be sold. I'm taking this out to be sold. And then I put some on our farm. So guys, that's how we do it. So I'm going to share with you how I do it. How I actually um, collect the black soldier fly compost. You know, I'm here for you and I'm here to give you the best information so far so you can have a healthy black soldier fly farm. So this is what we have here. So you stay along with me and... Um, Let's go there. There are actually so much so much that I'm ready to prepare already. So, I'm going to put myself in here. Yep. I'm going to put myself in here so that you guys can actually be seeing what I'm doing. And you need to be very careful because sometimes you may put pupae in it. So when you're collecting the compost, or you're, you have to be very vigilant. The, the life cycle of a black soldier fly is 45 days. The life cycle of a black soldier fly is 45 days. So it's very short and... Your protein supply is guaranteed for your livestock. So this is some compost I've already gotten, you can see. So this pupae hasn't pupated already. They're still about to. It takes nine days for them to pupate. So sometimes nine to 11 days. So let me... Show you what I do. Okay, let me show you what I do. So, these are some already I've already collected from this batch at the side. what I have here. A combination of pupupe, pupe and some larvae. That's already about to turn into pupupe. 
pupil, I have to select my pupae from here, my pupae from here, and take into the love chamber, guys. This is what I'm selecting. If you can see, you see some of them have already. So this is where the work is. So it's not as easy as it is. The life cycle is very short, but this is where the work is. Now, what happens in this chamber that I have is, um, what's good is, when they want to uh, pupate, most of them crawl out of this uh, chamber and go to the other side where they are ready to pupate because when they start getting matured, they don't like being among the young ones. I don't know why. They just find themselves out of it because they'll need to be quiet for a while and then they turn into flies. So what I'm going to do now is separating them. They have reached the stage where you need to stop feeding them. There's a stage where you stop feeding them so that you are able to separate them and take out the compost. So I'm going to show you what I do in order to collect the compost. Um, I did for this batch here, for this in this part, that was yesterday and I wasn't in a good mood to film. So today I'm going to film for you so you can see how you can get your black soldier fly compost, which is very nutritional still. So stay with me as I do the work, as I do the work. As you can see in our chamber here, you can see some black soldier flies have gone in already. These are the ones that are, have told themselves that I am not young anymore. I am ready to become an adult. <laughs> so guys, stay with me. And then we go through. It's a lot of work today. A lot of work. So don't get tired. Nope. Don't get tired. It's better to put it in something like this so you can easily separate them and after you have separated then you shift this and put this in here the compost because we are trying to liberate this chamber Make sure you take only the dark ones, the ones that are already this type. You put it in here. So tell me, have you have you started your black soda fly farm? What are your challenges? What are the challenges you're facing? Um... I'm almost done, guys. And I'll show you how I separate them. what I've done this is what I'm doing ah, 
So guys, I have separated the pupae from the larvae. So I'm going to show you how to get your compost. Now this is our shift shifter. And I'm going to put this on here. Now while you put it in here, remember that some larvae will be finding themselves down. That's why you need to do it real quick. Then you drop this back. You drop the larvae back into this batch. And you look again, you see you have some compost here. You do the same thing. But you do it very quickly. And you drop this here. also get something thin like this much thinner if you notice that the, the lava is running through your this you do like this and then come look at what I'm doing you see only the Only the compost is going downwards. We <sighs> make sure that you don't press very hard on them. So this is how you separate them. <sighs> so let me take But this is the difficult part in black soda fly where you have to separate them. So So if you look here, this is our sieve. So you put it on here. I think I've put too much and since I'm alone I won't be able to carry the weight so you shake this you have to make sure that they are they are past baby stage because if they are not past baby stage, you have the baby larvae going through this, which is not going to be good. You just rub on it gradually. This is so heavy. If not, I would have been doing this with my mom or somebody. So, checking underneath, you see how. So 
you come look at it now, it's a lot easier to select. Make sure you're gentle with them because they are very fragile as well. And this should be compost because if compost only <clears throat> compost will be able to pass through this. It shouldn't be fresh stuff. So this is ready now to be selected. And then I'll put it in this bowl. How much it is in remember to do it gently and fast so that they don't get stuck inside the Turn my gloves. <laughs> Take a look at it. So you can see how it's left. So now guys, put this in here and you select. So this is how we collect that's so that's like compost. This is the hard work here. <laughs> so I have to work now. So see you guys later. Just let me know what next you want me to do. Somebody has requested that I do a video um, butchering a chicken. <laughs> so I'm going to do that video later when I want to eat chicken now i'm so busy um so guys see you guys later if you have any questions do pop them down below until next time i remain your seasoned farmer now i'm a farmer i'm not a medical micro, uh, microbiologist or a medical professional i'm a seasoned farmer now Bye bye <laughs>